Hey guys, Kashaya here. Welcome back to my channel. So I just got home from Office Depot. And no, well, Office Max, Office Depot, same sort, right? And I figured I could go ahead and film uh, me taking everything out of the bag and what I just got because I picked up some planner stuff. So if you're interested in seeing what I picked up from Home, I was say Home Depot, Office Depot, make sure you keep on watching. I went to Office Depot to pick up some um, dashboards and inserts from the brand Tool, T-U-L. Um, apparently they've been around for a while. I am new to the brand Tool. Um, I was I discovered the brand because of their notebooks that have charging covers where you can put your phone on top of it and it'll charge. And I actually saw them in store once and I've been thinking about it since I saw it like eight months ago, but I wasn't paying $70 for this notebook. And recently it went on clearance for like $18. So I ordered it from Office Depot online and I ordered a set of 2021 calendar inserts to go in it, but I didn't really know that like it was a calendar planning system. I thought it was like a notebook and you could just add a calendar to it. So I'll insert a picture of the one, the notebook I have here so that you can see it. And so upon further research, apparently Tool is a huge brand. Like they have all kinds of stuff. And when I went in Office Depot, I was shook because they definitely have a lot. So if you have a local Office Depot when you go in, Tool has its own row. They're typically next to um, like notebooks and stuff. But then they also have a separate planner display. So Tool makes letter size and half letter size notebooks. Um, and they have a ton of accessories to go with it, a ton of different color options. I mean, the notebooks alone, I saw like 10 color options. And then I noticed as I was walking through Office Depot, just checking things out, the Tool had a huge planner display for their 2021 planners. And I didn't pick up a planner, but I did get some of the accessories to show you. So they make notebooks, planners, um, legal pads I think and then also they make really good pens their pens are really nice so let's dive into what I got so again I did not get uh, a I didn't get a planner um just because I literally I don't need <laughs> I don't need a planner um and it's not and I mean obviously I could still use like the actual notebook and stuff but there was no point I wasn't going to be using those 2021 inserts but I did grab another notebook. So the first thing I want to show you is actually a notebook that I grabbed on clearance. This was like on sale for like $6. And this is just a tool notebook. This is their regular notebook letter size. And this is so cute. And they do sell these covers um, individually. I didn't see the pink one, but they had a ton of covers. And they had this one and the navy blue one on sale. So, so you can see how it looks. Um, and then every one of their products has like this little how-to section in the beginning that shows you how to do everything. And then let's check this notebook out though, because I, have I haven't seen this before. The, the charging notebook I have is just regular notebook paper. So what's, re what's really cool is the first couple sheets is an undated calendar. So you can fill in your own dates. And it looks like they give you enough for a full year in here. Then the next sheet are labels that you can write on. I can't believe I got this so cheap. And then you, what's included in the rest is you have these really cool clear dividers throughout and they have little pockets on them. So it's like a divider, it's a divider with a pocket so that you can store your notes. Somebody's dog is like having a whole heart attack outside but we gonna keep filming it. So this is the pocket. And then here's how the line paper looks. And I love this. So this is the disc. So Tool uses a disc crown system. And this is why I'm really obsessed with it because the other disc bound notebooks I have are from Martha Stewart and I really, really love it. Like I was using Martha Stewart notebooks before I even got back into planning and I was already using, for them, I was just using the, the paper refills. Like that, that's what I thought it was, but those are actually called inserts. So Tool actually sells a ton of different sized rings and they're like four bucks for a pack, but the different sizes, they go bigger. So if you wanted to have a 300 page notebook, they actually have a disc for that. So that's something to note too. If you get the letter size or half letter you can actually take these rings out and replace them and they also came in different colors so this is the first thing I got and this was in the clearance section so you 
you're not gonna see this in the tool section. You have to go to the clearance section to see these notebooks. Okay, the next thing I grabbed was some more tab dividers. And I actually already have a set of their plain dividers, which I'll use in my charging one, but I wanna put this in this pink one. And this came from the collection that was with their 2021 calendars. So their 2021 calendars have this like kind of aesthetic, very Baroque-ish, um, and their planners come in a ton of different colors. So I have a set of dividers here. And then also from that collection, I got a set of their pens. I already have a set of their pens. I have like a four pack of just regular jet black. And these are the metallic gel pens and the jet black ones write really, really good. And then I'll show you the back of this. I think you'll see the design a little bit better on the pens. This is really, really cute. So I grabbed that. Okay, so staying on with the letter size, I picked up these card inserts. They call them business card pages. The back says, as you accumulate business cards from contact conferences, et cetera, et cetera, you can place them here for quick and easy reference. Each page has 14 pockets that can hold two cards each facing front and back. So this entire set gives you space for 84 cards. Um, just to let you know, like average pricing, I can't remember how much everything is individually. Um, if you look this stuff up, like all of it's online on Office Depot, but in total, I spent $95 at the store and I had a 20% off your total purchase coupon. Okay, so here is how the card inserts look. At first I was like, is this really a card insert? Because I thought that they were the length of this and I'm like, I'm going to take this back if it is, but they actually flip up like this. This is really cute. I like this a lot. And I definitely have a ton of business cards that just take up space. But some of them I actually do need to use. So, so anyway, here's how it looks. And again, you know, you could just go ahead and insert it. So let me grab a notebook. You get, you get multiple sheets. Let me grab the notebook. See if I can show you how to insert something on camera. This is really big. I don't have a half letter tool, but I have a half letter um, Martha Stewart. So I wish I had that with me to show you all. But yeah, you just have to like clip it in. Like I'm gonna have to do this laying down because this is heavy. Just gonna clip it in. And of course this is thicker plastic so it takes a little bit more effort. But regular paper doesn't take all this. So yeah, it just clips in. And you just go ahead, close your notebook. This is really cool. I wish I knew about this when I was going to a ton of conferences, you know? It would have made my life a, a lot easier. And then this is just boring. Like, this is just regular fill paper. Um, this is just their, this is their narrow ruled refill paper. They have a couple different types of refill paper. This is actually pink. I don't think the, the camera is picking this up because of the sunlight, but this is actually pink. So it's just regular line paper with a heading section for like a date and a title. They had a, a pack, they had a really thick pack. Well, they have, well, they have a couple thick packs. So they have a really thick pack if you want like a full 2021, like each day has its own page kind of thing. They had that, then they had a big pack that had four different types. So they had, it had this grid paper and then they had this project management insert that I wanted really, really bad. So I loved how it looked, but they didn't sell it individually. Like I looked <laughs> all throughout the aisle and they didn't have it individually. And I would have just bit the bullet and got the four pack, but I don't like grid paper. Like I know that grid paper is really popular in the planner community, but I ain't here for it. So anyway, I just got some pink fill paper. Um, if you want to see a video on what I use these notebooks for, because I do go through notebooks real fast. I go through to the point where I had to pause using notebooks and I just went to legal pads. Um, this is the this is what happens when you're a creative and an entrepreneur. You just go through paper. So let me know in the comments if you want that video. Okay, so then moving on the, to the half letter stuff. So this is a three pack. Um, this was like 10 bucks, but it's called the expansion set. And so this is like the mini version of the big pack that I was talking about. So here, well, the mini version, this is the half letter version. So this comes with 25 narrow rule, 25 grab, 25 dot, 25 projects management, um, the to-do list notepad, which I'm gonna open this up. And then they gave you an expansion set of discs. So I was telling you that you can buy discs of different sizes. And they have this in, in full letter size too. They have it where it comes with like post-it notes and stuff. 
but here's how the disc look so i probably won't be using this anytime soon but it's nice to have and then this to-do list pad and the reason why i did go ahead and bite the bullet on this is because it would be ten dollars more expensive if i would have bought this and then um the the fill paper for this so i just went ahead and got it but i'll go ahead and show you um the way that this looks so this is the project management one i wish i would have put something in the middle this is the grid lined one this is the one that's similar to the pink it's just half letter sized and then this is the dotted one so like i said i don't have i just really love this i think this is really cute I don't have a tool half letter. I have a Martha Stewart one that I could use in the meantime. However, stay tuned for this because I have, I pre-ordered a 2021 planner set from Fancy Plans. And it was, y'all, it was like $55 for the cover, the front and back cover, the rings, and all of your 2021 dated inserts. And you could pick the layout. She had like eight different layouts. You get a pen, you get the pen loop. I mean... It was a lot and i was like okay great i can try out a disc bound system for a really reasonable price so i'm going to be using a lot of this especially in 2021 for the dated planner because i do want to try out dated um next year so anyway so then the next set of inserts i got this is for i think this is for full letter full letter size it might be able to fit in half letter let me see yeah it can fit in half letter so this is a undated daily um insert so basically you can write the date in at the top and then it has the full schedule i love this i'm surprised i have not come across something like this as a printable on etsy because this is a huge pet peeve of my like hourly planners the way my life is set up okay and the way my client calls and meetings are set up i need to be able to see all my tasks and I can't allocate, I don't do a good job of allocating tasks to time slots like that. It's really what's the priority and when do I have a gap in my day to get to it. So I like the, op the option of being able to insert this whenever I do want to see something hour by hour, whenever I have a bunch of different appointments or whatever's going on, or if I do want to test out planning projects out hour by hour. This is like a really non-committal way <laughs> to test it out. So I'm really excited to try this couple of my things i of course picked up some stickers and these are punch so you can put them in the planner so these are really cute you get two sheets of five different types of designs um so for two for 10 sheets total so they duplicate each one so of course on the front is to do is important they give you some box checklist a bunch of little circle reminders things like that and then we have some post-it notes and I love that this is punched so this can go in the notebook, which is really, really nice. I got the business card pages for the half letter size. And then the last thing I actually got, I'm really excited about this. This is a portable punch. So it's an 11 custom carved, uh, wait. So it's a tool, cause this has 11 in front of it. So it says 11 tool custom carved punches. Punch up to three 18 pound pages works with pages up to 11 inches, removable base chip tray. And the disc bound hole punches are expensive. I hadn't seen a disc bound hole punch under $40. The hole punch I bought that I used for my A5 and personal was all of $9. So I was excited to see this. This was 29, I think. So here's what it looks like. I don't know how, it, how does it open. I mean, I know an, an immediate con is that you can only do three pages at a time, but still. Okay, so this is how it opens up. And then I, I think what's really cool about this is that unlike the ring bound system, the ring bound system is, okay, so with this, the difference between half a letter and full size is not the spacing in between. It's just how many punches you put in it. And it even tells you like, well, it doesn't tell you in here where, where things go. But basically here there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Half letter has eight punch, has eight 
disc in it and then full size has 11 i believe if you're a disabound user and i'm lying tell me in the comments because i'm pretty sure i'm telling the truth though because i was i literally when i was in my office i held up my martha stewart half letter to my full letter tool chargeable planner and it was the same distance in between the rings with the ring bound system it's not like that like if you have like my louis vuitton mm and my gm which is the same as a5 personal like i literally miss hole punched once like us basically in my little planner hole punch you have to move the knobs so you have to, and it's marked it'll tell you where to put it for a5 so i had it where at the top i had a5 but at the bottom i had personal and i was trying to put that in my a5 planner and the holes didn't line up so i had to re-punch them whereas with this it's like it's gonna fit right unless you're trying to put a full like even if you want to put a half letter in the letter size you can do that it's going to look awkward but i could see it which is why i grabbed this especially if you use like notepads and you want to go ahead and insert a notepad within a week i've been doing that in my ring bound anyway i could see that being a thing this dog y'all don't feed sparky so he could stop barking interrupting my youtube career thank you okay so I've been doing that lately, inserting like little scribbled off my notepad stuff in my planner. So you can put the half letter in the full letter. You can't obviously put the full letter in the half letter, but y'all get where I'm going with that. So I'm excited to try this out um, for future reference. So yeah, this was my, uh, I was gonna say Ulta. This was my Office Depot haul. Let me know down in the comments if you have tried out any tool system stuff. Let me know what you tried out. Is there something that I missed that you think I should get? Because y'all know I'm about this life. Um, if you uh, have not tried any of their stuff, do you think you will? Um, I do think just off of initial impressions, I did not think outside of the chargeable uh, notebook, their stuff isn't too expensive in my opinion. Like the little inserts range between five to 10 bucks unless you were getting the full year. That's when it went up to 20 something. But I think because a lot of this stuff is in store, it's like really accessible for beginners. If you're new to planning and you're trying to figure out, you know, what you want to get, you know, between Office Depot's ring disc bound system. And then you also have stuff at Michael's. You have your, uh, the Michael's A5 Recollections Journals. You have your Happy Planners. You have a couple different options of things to try out. So if you do go to Office Depot, make sure you sign up for their free rewards program because they do send nice coupons in the mail and via email like i said i did have a 20 percent off purchase so before that 20 percent off it was definitely i think the total was close to one one ten one fifteen um so yeah so anyway make sure you all subscribe to this channel like this video and i'll talk to you all in the comments bye